Well, we're going to have to obviously play extremely well. They, you know, they have one of the best offenses in the state uh, in any classification. So we'll, we'll, uh, you know, we're going to have to gang tackle number one, who is our best running back. And uh, I feel like if we could play assignment defense and tackle well, we'll have a chance. But if we if we don't do those things well, it, it, it's not going to be uh, pretty for us. He's very special. You know, obviously he's the number one running back in the state, if not the country. And uh, he's got the size, he's got the speed, he's got the quickness. Uh, yeah, he's just a, he's got all the tools to be a special back down the road, and he's another one that's got a bright future ahead of him. Uh, we we got to come out the gate fast. We can't we can't get off to a slow start like we have uh, a couple of games in the playoffs. We we got to come out and have a fast start, and hopefully we can execute on both sides of the ball and uh, and make it a game. Our goal is to try to get you know into the fourth quarter and make it a game and. Who knows, uh, we've won, we've played well in the fourth quarter the last two weeks, so hopefully we can continue to play well. Very, very good, you know, we've had great weeks of practice and they understand our goal and, uh, you know, our goal is to win the state championship and anything short of that is going to be a disappointment. So, you know, I think our kids are, are ready for the game. I know the coaches are ready for the game and, you know, we're going to throw our kids out and see what happens and uh, whatever happens, happens. But I know one thing, our kids are going to play hard. I hope so, you, you never know, you know, We've been there the last couple of years, and we'd like to go back and have an opportunity, but obviously we've got to win Friday night first.